Okay, so this is a, a tutorial for how uh, we're going to be using Teams at the high school, for Kimberly High School, uh, during our school closure. Um, so try to, you know, imagine yourself from, from the perspective, uh, starting this for the first time. Once you've done it once, you're going to be fine. Uh, but what you're going to first do um, is obviously you're going to go to Kimberly uh, High School or Kimberly School District where you can get into your Office 365. You've done that before. Having said that, you're going to find that some of the resources you're going to need are actually here on uh, Kimberly High School's page. So you have to choose high school, there's departments, and then you can pick a department like Mr. Welch's math department. You come in and you're going to find things like office hours, uh, things like that. We're really trying to make sure that we have time set aside for you to come and find us. So let's assume you get into your Office 365 and you're going to click on this Teams. Now if your teacher has set everything up, you should already be in some Teams. When I go look at my Teams, um, I've got physics, I've got math department, I've got different things like that. You can turn on, um, you can turn on uh, notifications if you'd like to, uh, just so you kind of know when people are on. But I'm going to go ahead and click, this is the test class for KHS, and I'm going to choose to join this class right here. I'm gonna, there's already a session going. I'm going to go ahead and click join now. Now, I'm in this meeting with Mrs. Bollinger now. But what I'm going to do first things first is I'm actually going to mute my microphone. At least that's what you should do as a student. You can choose to turn your camera off if you don't want anyone to see you. Um, if you turn your camera off, your initials will show up, but nothing else. But for sure we want you to turn off the microphone. If you want to ask a question, we're going to ask that you get your teacher's attention by clicking on the conversation chart. And so right here, uh, don't ask. All right, right here, I can put in a question like, um, I am confused on uh, number 34. Maybe I'm doing a math assignment, and I'm confused about number 34. I can submit that. Now my teacher can say, okay, Mr. Welch, go ahead and ask your question. And, and then I can turn my microphone back on. This is a way so that we don't have a hundred kids all asking questions or just talking in the background. We want to be able to let the teacher focus on that. So that's a way for us to do that. Um, your teacher sometimes will take control and, and force you guys all to see the same thing. That's a great resource there. But then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to stop this. Now if your teacher chooses to record, okay, uh, something will come up on the screen. It'll tell you that you're being recorded. Um, and so just so you understand, that's again another reason why I want to turn that microphone off uh, for your own privacy there. Okay, so we get to the end of this. We're going to stop recording. I'm going to stop the recording. You know, you're not going to be recording. The teacher should do the recording for you. And then you're going to hang up. Uh, you can tell whether you like the quality or not. At the end, that recording will be right here on um, our page here. And so that's going to be a great way for you in case you miss a day you can come in and uh, and get information there. Anytime you want to start a new conversation or ask a question, communicate with your teacher, obviously you can do it by email, but you can also jump right in here and say, um, Mr. Welch or Mr. Worth, how do, how do I answer these questions? And then your teacher can be prepared maybe the next time you have a meeting scheduled uh, to, to go ahead and, and make that happen. So hopefully that, that kind of gives you an idea of how you're going to get in, how you're going to um, how you're going to get into the conversation and what norms we have uh, expected of you. Again, always turn your microphone off unless you're asked to speak by your teacher, and feel free to turn off your video if you don't want people to see you. Uh, you just want to be able to um, quite put questions over there on the conversation bar. Uh, if you have questions, uh, just email, um, ask questions. Again, here you can see that that just showed up that 17 second uh, deal. Hopefully that'll get you going. Um, again, email your teachers, ask them how they're using different tools and resources, and we'll see you uh, when we all get done with this. Good luck.